seeing patrol cars going left and right. This is obviously a very active situation, and we're going to stay here and let you know what happens. Yeah, we've got so many police departments from so many areas. We're going to go to a live picture. Gloria, stay where you are because I'm being told that we've got a live shot now. Uh, as you said, that this man may be traveling in a red or orange Mercury sedan, and look what is happening there. Looks like shots were fired. There is the red, orange Mercury car sedan that you were talking about. Shots right. are and being I'm fired. You yeah, I, uh, they're tell actually you that shooting at him in the car. I don't know if you can see what I'm saying, but police have guns drawn on someone in that car. Let's watch what happens. Ah, oh, we had to... All right, we did not... We had to break away from that. We had to um, break away from that, but it looks as if what you said, Gloria, about the police looking for a man in a red-orange Mercury sedan, that that could be the car that that suspect, Charlie Christopher Bates, could be in his ex-girlfriend's car or his girlfriend's car. We don't know, but we just saw there a few minutes ago police firing at someone inside that car and we presumably we believe that that is the suspect Charlie Christopher Bates who's been on this crime spree overnight home invasions held people hostage sexually assaulted women as many as four women robbed people this has been going going on since overnight and now I'm waiting for confirmation what what can you guys tell me about what we